Hello everyone, welcome back to Doom. Voicecom. You'll find the Helix Stone in Olivia's private archival lab deep within this facility. Deep. Few have ever seen the stone. But if you came to us for a reason, you might be able to see something in it we haven't. So the first thing I'm thinking is, look how cool these glass textures are. That is amazing, I love it. In Doom 3, they had those wonky, those wobbly windows um, that let you look outside onto the Mars surface, but they weren't nearly as well. They weren't, they weren't as glassy, and there was only one texture as far as I remember. So I was just uh, having a little look at the. I do like to look at the scenery in a game that is this well made, and they put so much effort into it. So it's, it seems unfair not to. Um, I hope you'll forgive me. I, isn't that a weird? Like, that seems like an archaic word. It's like honour. Forgiveness, right? I hope you'll forgive me. Well, not that much to forgive. It's like, forgiveness seems so highbrow. I don't need forgiveness. Don't worry about forgiveness. Um, but I hope that you don't worry too hard that I tend to... Wait a minute. Talking. The demons prophesied his return. Return? If you will. It could jeopardize the entire mission, for he is the only one who can stand against them. That's me. She's talking about me. With hair that doesn't seem to have the same effects on holograms as the rest of... Hold this up. Uh, I was talking about forgiveness in the way in which we use the word. I already see that forgiveness is... It seems like such an archaic thing to say. That's okay. I mean, you can say archaic okay things. I don't mind about that. I hope that you will forgive me for... What is this? Siphon grenade. Um, f not finishing my trains of thought when I'm watching these things. Siphon grenade was designed to work with the Doom Marine's Praetor suit, specifically to make use of the Argent receptors found in the gloves and the chest plate. So, the Doom Marine was found long enough ago that we managed to develop something to use the Praetor suit before I awoke, for whatever reason that was. Positively charged particle field in the operator's hand. Grenade release and explodes, it releases a negative charge for just a few minutes. Track Argent and then Doom Core in the radius. Tearing a plasma from this and positively charged prayer to suit and tracks a negatively charged Argent and gathers the flat. So how do I get to that? <laughs> this happens a lot. I hope, again, that you will forgive me. Switch weapon. Next equipment, F1. I don't feel like this is correct. For start, I never switch weapon with this. So let's, um, not this. So let's just change equipment with this. Next equipment, done. Previous equipment, done. And then uses obviously E. So I'm guessing it's a piece of equipment that we just picked up. Siphon grenade. Scared me. Didn't need to, if that's all very well and good. If this is all the same to you. Uh, doesn't look like there's a way in here directly, but I'm wondering if there's going to be a way around. I'd like to get in, because there's anything... Oh, I can just press this. Come on. There's an environment. Uh, Lazarus Labs. Blah, blah, blah. That's percent you reckon. Being down here means that we have very high clearance. I couldn't help but notice, by the way, that the uh, textures on the way in were looking a little bit low resolution. I was expecting these to be a lot higher. That's like quite two levels of resolution. Have I accidentally... Set it down. You... Uh, just bear with me, will you? It's page size. Everything's on ultra. This is silly. It's gritty, by the way. I hope that's okay. Um... That is including quality. That's the only thing not an ultra. I believe it doesn't have an ultra, so um, it's just the game. Uh, let's continue. Open, please. Thank you. Hello. What have you got to say for yourself? Nothing? Very well. That is demonic. That is a checkpoint, but also a service elevator. No, that's a lockers. Okay. Remember, doubts are the seed of descent. I thought that the subtitle said that it was the seed of dentists. I love these faster things because you can chain them. And the fact that they stagger longer means that we can 
we've got a good synergy going on, which I explained when I set it up, but, you know, it's always good to blow your own horn every now and then. This was always my playstyle for every game ever, by the way, so please don't feel like you are being... Um, cheated out of a... That was stunned, come on. Out of a uh, opportunity to see me just beat the shit out of things for no reason. That's munitions, which I really don't need right now. Nice. We didn't need that. Hello. Your friends were here. They could have helped. I mean, they didn't seem like they wanted to. Let's have a quick look at the, uh, this, because we want to see... Ah, uh, we could be okay for munitions right now. I feel like I'm going to need them on the way out. So I'm going to save them. That may not be the correct thing to do. The other thing is I don't remember if I have finished Trains of Thought. So if I have already finished my Train of Thought, asking for forgiveness for not finishing trains. Here we go. It's lagging again, isn't it? Come on. First of all, why can't I get up there? Second of all, what's happening, computer? Let me, uh... Yeah, it's loading in a lot of textures at once, I think. Sometimes it happens. Uh, I apologise if I've already finished my train of thought about not finishing trains of thought. But also... I didn't really mean to do that, necessarily. Um, if I didn't, then... I have a habit of being distracted by the game I'm playing, which I think is perfectly understandable. That may have hurt, but I'm not really sure. Um, I think we should use the shot. Uh, let's use the super shotgun for a while. Because it seems like it could be helpful. Uh, in this, let's just use this pistol. <laughs> it's pretty powerful. I mean, against these simple enemies, I don't really have a problem with using the pistol, especially since it has infinite ammo. There's no point wasting what could be a precious commodity. Um, oh, I see an Im a haste up there. I see a haste. It could be press a commodity of ammo, he says, and then just wastes two shotgun shells for no reason. It's up here. Right, it's just up here, downy part of the level. I'm okay with this. Um, not seeing much in the way of um. Excuse me. Not seeing much in the way of any ammunition that can help me in a direct manner, i.e. chainsaw ammo or BFG ammo. Which is the BFG using... No, it's got its own ammo. So it's not that. What is this? Oh, heck. Get out of here. Nah, done it wrong, look. There's HP. Absorb it before you die. Oh, come on. What is this universe, right, where you can have this much HP, and if you get to zero, you are completely dead, but anything above that, you can infinitely heal without taking any damage. Come on. If there's HP around, and you are... I'm just going to open it. <clears throat> if there's HP around, should have shot these things first, and you exist, still, even if you're dying, the HP should let you be not dead. Right? It's health points. It's hit points. You can take more health and hits. It's just very silly. Oh, let's go up here. That is helpful. Also, now I'm here. Kind of wanted to get you in midair. That's okay. I kind of think it's funny when these jokers uh, get owned. <laughs> They're in midair. They're flying around all la da Look at me, aren't I the best? No, you're freaking not, mate. Pardon my Spanish. But as it happens, there's a certain quantity of you. So Hello. Where are you? There you are. Oh, I can just go down there. All right. Honestly, I thought this was a big pit that I'd woe betide me if I fell down. You know? Cowabunga. Is that all? Okay. Let's just begin this. Um, I'm wondering if rocket launch might be a good start here. Because there really are some rockets. Uh, that's not it, though. Where is it? Oh, it's there. It's only got 30 shots. Uh, 
Remote detonation is probably my favourite thing about the rocket launcher. Although, if it was the Unreal Tournament rocket launcher, or the Unreal rocket launcher for that matter, I'd be a little bit happier, because that actually has some pretty badass capabilities. Kill. Kill. Nice. That's one you don't get to see very often, so I'm happy to have uh, had the opportunity. I'm assuming that there's going to be something that we don't want to mess with coming around the corner pretty soon. No, no. Nah, this. Uh, right, shotgun and... Okay, fine. We'll deal with this in a minute. There's too many things at the moment for me to satisfactorily very well uh, arrange my weapons so that I can switch between them at will that was a great dodge by the way in case you weren't watching which you were because it's literally all you're doing right now let's get this rocket launcher there we go give me that and then get this joker out of the way where are you? something way more powerful than them has just arrived Kill. Look how long they stun for, that's amazing. Walked all the way across this whole map to get to that Joker. And I should pick up that haste before it basically is useless to me. Well, that was a bad idea. Low health and then immediately not low health. What happened? Kill that because it's more fun. I like this speed, actually. Can we just have this speed by default? I don't like the fact that my mouse is sped up, but at least it feels like it has. Sweet. So we can get up here, get up here. There's a few more bits up here. Yeah, armor and stuff. That noise, uh, I <laughs> just realized is your, uh, your haste running out. I noticed that that actually explodes when the, um, the, the power up ends, which I think is what happened on the previous episode when the quad damage ended. It exploded me next to a barrel. Who's that again? What? I'm hoping that 42% uh, health or anybody watching will leave me a comment to explain to me what it is that I just saw. That I just picked up. Because I am at a loss to explain it. I don't, I don't remember seeing it explained at any point. Um, they're just picking up these little balls of energy that don't... Don't seem to run out. Oh, hello. Jessica, you should, you should go, do it yourself. This looks like a. I don't know. I was gonna say it looks like a place the prayer tool suit comes from, but oh, getting a bit. The difficult here. Huh? Can't actually get in there. Is there a... Is it in... Uh, Fallout, maybe? Ah. Come on, that's actually really obvious. What's the matter with you? Uh, in Fallout? Ah, that would have exploded so hard. Follow this around. Nothing. There is something. Ah. Come on, let's get in there. Nice. Elite guard. Ah. If Elite guard of Crescent come from the Lazarus Lash, you will be going to the Lazarus Lash. It was even necessary to apply kill chip in these uniforms that might also be controlled using some magical. Kill chip response for Lazarus way of changing it. So one of them killed them all at once. Got a prayer toss suit upgrade token, which is getting a little bit silly uh, because I really don't care about upgrading this thing anymore. <sighs> Next upgrade here is immune to explosive barrel damage, which has actually killed me a couple of times right now. <laughs> um, it only costs three. Yeah. Make it so. Right. They won't be a problem anymore. I was being very petty about that until it got to the point where I needed it. And then I kind of wish I had it. 
So, uh, we had that. I'm not really using this Gauss Cannon, but I feel like I should be. So we got this one where you can't move, but you can beat the crap out of everything with it. That's a very fast charge up period. Um, so it, it could be okay. I kind of just want to see if I can shoot out of here. It's very difficult to know which weapon is going to be good in any situation, quite frankly. Um, I, all the enemies have literally just hidden themselves. Presumably that's a scripted event, because... They were wandering around here quite freely when I got here. Um, so maybe we want the shotgun for now, whilst we're inside. There's another one of these jokers as well. Let's have a look what you've got. I don't really... Again, what difference does it make? Let's, let's bite that, sure. Um, it means we can switch out the gas cannon for this other one. Which could be way better, but, you know, it's basically the, um... Oh. Ah, oh, wait. It's basically the, the, the assault rifle, so let's just buy this. Come on, let's just fully, fully equip, fully kit out, get this thing sorted. Let's, um, no. That one, yeah. So there's nothing in that. There's nothing in this direction. Kind of looks like there is. There is. There we go. Helpful. Again, we could be making much better use of the chainsaw because it will one-shot any enemy at various costs. Not a fan of that noise. Oh, you got blood. I suppose you're allowed blood. Who am I to begrudge you blood? Is this a secret or is this where I'm supposed to go? Sure, I saw a possessed one down here just now. So if I go in there. What's that? The map. We can have a look at the map. That seems fine. Impact. Slightly, yeah. Something back here? No. We've got our uh, full environment here. Let's read this. Grant to the high. Oh, we've read that one. Subdivision. Well, it's a badge of honor, but we're not really UAC staff, so I'm kind of hard pressed to agree that maybe that counts. Uh, that looks like a thing we can be doing. So we should get back up there. This looks like early Doom stuff. This is like what the original Doom would have looked like had we had this technology back then. Which is really cool. I'm actually into that. Again, no point wasting ammo, but actually conserving it to this degree? Also not really worthwhile. Cyberdemon. Uh, is that what I just pulled apart with the chainsaw? Because that's cool. Titans rather than respect. Please go several ways. Ancient Balgar demon. Educational and inspirational exhibit. Yeah, sure. <laughs> <clears throat> Reanimate. Not a good idea. So it's a cyber demon because they found an ancient demon and made it cyber. Quite literally. That was such a cool animation. That's the sort of thing I wish I could do myself, but I do not have the strength. It's the sort of thing where you say you wish you could do it, and you don't have the strength. And then instead of just going ahead and getting the strength, you uh, just keep whinging about the fact you can't do it. Let's uh, plasma rifle you. Just kill it. I don't really care about... Oh, hello. Gauss cannon. 
Nice! <laughs> I know that it lags when that happened, but I'm so impressed with that. Speeding that thing up was exactly what we had to do. So this is where we came into. That's where we went through there. Right, right. Okay, cool. So we were going to go this way anyway, but now we've done it the long way and got an auto map for our troubles. Let's just check the map. Let's have a... Let's take a minute. Look at the map. Look at all of that. It's outstanding. I do like this map. Um, we're going to find a time trial. There's another... Um, that looks like something, and I was going to say it, and I was going to sound cool and knowledgeable about popular culture, but it kind of looks like the Opal logo, you know, the anything but English version of Vauxhall. Um, there's not that much. Okay, there's Argent Cells. There's two rune trials. What do you need? Kill eight demons with a single shot. Do you think that the BFG counts? Play a game of demon destruction. <laughs> so in Doom 3, there was obviously a turkey puncher? Which was just an arcade game. Oh. Don't let me in. Um. There was an arcade game in the... Uh, before, before everything kicked off, basically. That's so much fun. Uh, basically, you take control of the stick and you punch a turkey. It really isn't any more complicated than that. That was cool. Can't go in there. No. Uh, let's use this. Do that. Do that. I think I need eight demons at once to kill with a single shot before I can do that. Um, but the BFG may be the way of doing it. Seems pretty obvious, right? Use thing with huge amount of ammunition. Uh, huge amount of killing power. Are you seeing another way into that, by the way? It wasn't even there. It was way back here. Was it? It was here. It was. There is a way in there. But the hole is here, so there's a way into there, which implies, I don't know, way in there? Get off. There we go. Hmm. This is one of those doom things. How do we... How'd you get in there, then? How'd you do it? Hmm. Does it not seem like it should be off? There's a thing there. Where does that go? Nowhere. Can't break that, apparently. Nope. So I'm going to have to assume that at some point we end up coming back around that way and getting through the, bay the bottom of there, but let's keep going. There's no point wasting time. The key for the BFG, by the way, is too far away. Let's... <clears throat> settings. Since I'm not using these keys, let us put BFG on... Z. I think the chainsaw's okay on G. I can just about reach it. That seems fine. Chain gun is actually 8. It's interesting to see the almost reprioritization of weaponry in this version of Doom compared to previously, because back in the day, of course, Chainsaw was on, like, five. So a lot of things preparing me for a battle. <laughs> hey, here's a shitload of really useful things. Do you want, do you want them? Nothing, nothing sinister, I promise. Is this the way I'm going? Yes. I honestly feel like I've just completely left that behind, but... I did see that. Let's get this out and do this. Was that it? Yes. <laughs> then I'm okay. I would like to use this on you. K. 
kill you, then I would like... Oh, yeah, let's go in here because everything is attacking me. That wasn't a nice place to spawn. Up in the freaking air like that. Could have warned a guy. What is happening up there? Uh, I see a quad damage, so let's go and get that. This will last for ages. The reason I want it to last for ages is that you know, I want it to hurt things for a long time. Excuse me? It just died. Okay. Whatever. So the shields do eventually break. It's just... They're very stubborn about it. I was hoping it would last a little bit longer than that, if you don't mind. But okay. The range on that is actually really good as well, which I'm actually quite pleased about. On the... Um, What on the uh, on the on the pressing F thing, killing the dude? It's pretty okay. I mean, it's not stupendous, but it does mean that you can chain together a few decent glory kills without having to go totally out of your way to aim them, which is sometimes the hardest part. Uh, I did see another one. You could. Making me aware of it. Get rid of that. Where's this joker? There you are. Help. Uh, let's change to this one for now. All we can do with this is zoom in at the moment, but I think it would probably be, probably be a bit much if it had a uh, secondary fire as well. Well, maybe not. It's not like it's BFT, is it? Now, if that had a secondary fire, I'd be quite happy. Give me this. Where are you coming from? Oh, that was nice. Happy with that, especially since it didn't overkill it, so I could deal with the thing. <laughs> I love the slowdown. Uh, one of my favourite sounds in the whole world is the sound of a sound just slowing down. Why would you make a teleporter that does that? There's, an, there's another thing about this game: that teleporter does not fill me with joy. Yeah, that's a pretty average looking effect okay uh, so in doom 3 of course the teleporter was the thing that opened up the hellmouth it was the whole problem i climbed up there just to see what was happening and it turned out that might be the actual way to go well it's been a fairly long episode so i'm probably going to call it there but uh, we've got quite a lot this level to do, and presumably quite a lot more of this game to do. I'm actually surprised that it's lasted so long, apart from the fact that, of course, it's lasted this long because I'm so bad at it. Um, but thank you very much for watching. This is presumably our cyber demon here. This is not the thing I stabbed before. Um, yep, thank you very much for watching. Remember to like if you liked it. Leave a s comment if you have a comment, and leave a subscription if you have a subscription. Is that how that works? Uh, but until next time, uh, thank you for watching this episode, and I hope to see you in the next one. Bump.